Hello YouTube modeling community. Welcome to Morse Custom Model Shop. James Morse here saying God bless all here as always. Uh, another little update here on the Tom Daniels build where I'm working on the details for the uh, engine compartment. I've just about got it to where I'll put the engine in. I've got my radiator hoses made but I'm afraid they're a little bit too long. I'm going to have to get my engine in so I can get the length down on them. Here is my engine. See I've got it wired and so on like that. Got my radiator. You can't hardly see it but there's a little CNR decal on there. Uh, keep discovering things that aren't in the kit. So that keeps setting me back. I'll go back and redo things. Uh, there's no sun visors in this kit. So I found some of my spares box. There's no rear view mirror. So I found one of those. There was no, uh, oh, let me see. There was no outside mirrors. That gives you a hint right there as to the color the car is going to be. But I found some outside mirrors for it. I've uh, been working on wiring up the alternator getting it ready you can see here is the post for the battery hold downs to go on I don't know where these guys that do the photo etch parts get wire get wire so fine to fit through uh, this is aftermarket for wiring on this engine went off. I don't know if the battery's going low or what but anyway I had some flaws show up where I would put these parts on so I'm having to go back and re-sand the body and then I'll have to repaint it. But that's where we're at right now. Uh, I showed you that in that last video, the dash I made, this is included in the kit. This wasn't. There was no, no other instruments in the kit except for that one. So you can't run an engine without, you know, water temperature and oil pressure and all like that. So I had to put something on there. So that's what I'm doing right now. My body's painted and drying and I should uh, have another good update in a day or so depending uh, if I don't have to leave town we may have to go to Michigan for a funeral but uh, hopefully not it just depends on how things goes right here's my fuel block I've made for the fuel lines that will go back up under the console here the lines will come out and go into each one of the carburetors. That's why I decided to do that. So. There you go, guys. Uh, that's the detailing for right now. And I thank you for watching. Y'all have a good day.